Global food production relies on pesticides, fungicides and seed treatments in order to protect crops. But many of these products have adversely impacted the environment and human health and several have been banned by regulators. AIM listed Eden Research has been developing and is bringing to market sustainable chemical solutions for agriculture in order to protect food production, people and the planet. Sean, welcome. Tell us first of all about the genesis of Eden Research. Thanks, Sharon. Yeah, um, Eden is a company that was founded and, and is driven by the idea that we can solve problems that face us across a whole number of different industries, but we can do so with sustainable chemistry, right? So moving away from um, conventional synthetic chemistry into naturally sourced, naturally produced active ingredients that address the same problems historically. And so this has been a driver for our business. So our focus is very much today around sustainability in agriculture and horticulture, in other words, professional production of a wide range of crops. But for us, the fundamental belief is we can do what we've done historically with sustainable chemistry and we can do it just as well. What we've been very focused on is bringing a, a portfolio of three different plant-derived active ingredients to market for professional agriculture and horticultural uses. And, and we are quite unique in the sense that we are one of very few companies that have successfully registered three different active ingredients around the world. Those active ingredients then become our tools for formulating new products to tackle new and an increasingly wide array of different problems facing growers around the world. Um, from, from our perspective, we've invested very, very heavily in supporting the registration of those products and, and ultimately securing authorization around the world for our formulated products. And, and this is something that uh, you know, we're looking to continue in the future. You mentioned new products there. You have a new seed treatment coming to market. Tell us a bit about that and just how important that is. So for the past few years, we've been working with a company called uh, Corteva AgriScience. Corteva is the combined agri-science business of Dow and DuPont. Uh, and they're one of the global leaders in our industry. And in fact, they're one of the leading seed companies in the world. Uh, what we've identified jointly was an opportunity to help farmers improve their yields and reduce their costs by repelling birds, which are a major problem across a range of different crop types. Okay, um, What's been happening in Europe is that there is an uh, incumbent product that has been historically used in seed treatments as a bird repellent. And the regulatory authorities uh, across Europe and also in the UK have been very focused on removing that product from the market. Uh, we have identified that opportunity and worked with Corteva to come up with alternative solutions that have exactly the same efficacy. In other words, they do the same job just as well at the same cost, but without the environmental health, safety uh, and associated challenges. Why is the transition to sustainable agriculture just so crucial? Well, if we think about it, you know, the, the planet isn't getting any bigger. Um, we are very sensitive as, as a population about land use management. Deforestation has been proven to, to very much work against our, our objectives when it comes to carbon emissions and managing carbon emissions. So what does that mean? It means that a farmer needs to be able to produce as much or more than they ever have using the same amount of land. So it's not acceptable to expand your land use by 20% to deal with reductions in yield. And so um, how, do, how do we do that? Well, we bring sustainable chemistry to market that helps farmers produce just as efficiently, just as effectively as they historically have, but with chemistry that isn't particularly problematic from a health, safety, or an environmental perspective. So based on what you've said there now, what's your strategy going forward into the future? For us, um, we are really very much looking to build on the success that we've had over the course of the last three and a half years. Uh, three and a half years ago we raised uh, for us a relatively large amount of money and we've been very focused on deploying those investments uh, in, in accelerating product development, growing the capabilities that we have and bringing new products to market more quickly. Uh, and so for the foreseeable future 
we're wanting to leverage that progress and really accelerate it further by bringing more new products to market. Ecovelix, the seed treatment that I just mentioned, was actually um, developed over the course of the last three years, and so we're looking to add in even more new product categories and to expand the use of our existing products further. Sean Smith, good luck in your endeavors. Many thanks for joining us. Thank you. Thank you.